you guys never buy one of these things this brand or this type um, this is the Annie's hot comb um, with the very basic on and off switch I got this at the beauty supply store for like $14 I believe and um, it works fine but it heats up to 500 degrees and there's no way to control the heat on it so I turned it on like I plugged it in and turned it on this morning and um, yeah I laid it on this towel so that I could protect it from the marble so the marble wouldn't get damaged on the sink and look like it melted right through the towel it burned right through the towel it won't even come off like look at that you see that <laughs> so yeah I wouldn't recommend this type of hot comb if you're gonna buy one buy um, the Andes A-N-D-I-S or just like a, a a different brand but definitely not this one <laughs> just don't buy this one and, it, and maybe they have different types uh, I haven't looked into it but maybe they have different types under this brand that you can maybe purchase online but if you buy this thing from the beauty supply store the cheap $14 one you guys you truly truly get what you pay for so yeah and I can't return this <laughs> workout brunch so baked butter tortillas uh, egg scramble with sauteed onion turkey bacon and tuna which is the bacon ranch tuna that I showed you with some avocado on top I know it doesn't look so it doesn't look very appealing but <laughs> I couldn't make it pretty um, and I added some hot sauce on top just to give it a little bit of kick and I am gonna have this with my water. I just had my apple cider vinegar and my multivitamin. Girl, it's on. My new favorite thing. I know this is very aesthetically pleasing, especially since I already took a sip of this. <laughs> but this is my smoothie. I made it with uh, bananas and peanut butter and granola and a little bit of milk well I filled it up halfway with milk actually um, and I did use regular milk because I wanted to get the Oatly but I didn't get it so um, I'll probably get it like in over the next couple of days when I go back to the grocery store actually I don't need any more food because like we are fully stocked um, with food the thing that I really doubled up on was eggs uh, because I eat lots of eggs hey guys how are you I hope you're doing well so today is Thursday and um, uh, it's about noon right now um, I have been here working since 7 a.m. I tried to vlog uh, earlier this morning but um, it just didn't go well I was swamped with students and calls which is great but um, yeah I'm restarting the vlog now for that reason um, and welcome back by the way welcome back to the vlog um, for those of you who are new here hello uh, thank you so much for being here my name is Lachelle and for those of you who have been with me for a while welcome back thank you for watching today and if you're not subscribed I hope you subscribe um, I know I haven't been uh, very active this week or last week rather because um, I have been uh, dealing with this whole situation and just trying to keep my uh, ear to not the ground but to the heavens to hear what God is saying and um, you know just trying to help people as much as I can um, I have been more active on Instagram so if you want to 
know what I get up to on a daily basis. Um, you can follow me over there on Instagram. I finally figured out how to <laughs> really use Instagram, um, IG stories and IGTV and all of that. So um, if you want to follow me over there, um, please follow me because um, when I'm not here, I'm over there and I'm posting um, on a regular basis. I've been posting every day. So yeah, that will kind of show you like what I get up to on a daily basis or what's what I'm thinking, you know, the whole nine. Um, and over here, um, I'm just chilling. <laughs> I have been just working uh, in the house. As you can see, I'm in my cozy comfies. And um, yeah, I just finished uh, my classes for the morning. So I was about to start my workout. You guys, I've been doing really great with my work at home or at home workouts. Um, so I do like my YouTube workouts um, from home and that's been going pretty well. And then I'm going to get some brunch and um, probably make a smoothie. You guys, I finally bought a new blender. Finally. So <laughs> um, I've been loving that. I'm going to show you um, my favorite smoothie, how I make it and everything. And um, yeah, just chilling at home. I hope you guys are self-quarantining. Please be obedient to what um, our leaders are telling us to do. Just, you know, um, if you have everything you need and uh, you really don't have a reason to go out, then please stay home um, because it protects not only you, but those around you as well as your family members and, uh, and loved ones. So, but I hope you're not afraid. I hope um, that you are well, that you have everything you need, and I hope you are not afraid. If you are afraid, please don't be. Um, the answer to that is to put your trust in the Lord, put your trust in God and in his promises and uh, stand on them. Just remember that God is still on the throne. This is still his creation and he is in complete control. So, um, yeah, that's what we that's what we need to be doing. Um, if you are a believer, you have no reason to fear. Um, if you're not a believer, you may be afraid. But uh, again, that is your answer. Put your trust in the Lord. Put your life in his hands. Surrender to him and you will be just fine. Um, so, yeah, I know that's the, like the short of it. But if you want to know more, <laughs> then um, you can follow me on Instagram. Also, you guys, that leads me to um, my next point because... I wanted to kind of get your uh, input on something um, because my mentality concerning like this YouTube platform um, and just my social media is, um, you know, it's as you know, it's always changing, but I believe it's growing and, e and evolving at the same time. And um yeah, like when I first started doing uh, YouTube, it was just like for like just a hobby. Um, but now, you know, I do take it more seriously and um, I want to make sure that I'm really helping people over here. You know, um, my channel is still very small um, and I want to see growth, but more so I just want to know that I'm help that I'm actually helping people not just on a surface level, not just, you know, with hair and makeup and, you know, um, you know, typical things like that, but just really helping people, encouraging, um, supporting, motivating, um, inspiring you, not just in a physical sense, but also in a spiritual sense, um, because um, that's what I'm called to do. And that is um, my main function, um, you know, above all else. First and foremost, I am not only a believer, but a servant <laughs> of, of God. And I, um, you know, my relationship with him comes first. Uh, my service to him comes first. Uh, my obedience to him comes first. And that's, you know, directly affects his people. It directly affects um, you all, everyone who uh, views me, everyone who hears from me, um, I am to be a reflection of him. So uh, just, you know, if you don't know anything else about me, remember that that is who I am first and foremost. 
um, and um, above all else. And uh, because of that, you know, I, everything I do kind of flows out of that. Um, I know I haven't been showing much here recently um, because I don't want to, um, you know, come off as preachy or anything, you know, like that. But at the same time, I have a re responsibility and a duty to share, you know, what God says to me and what he shows me that he wants me to share. Um, so I hope you understand that and I hope that is clear. And for that reason, um, uh, one thing is I wanted to kind of get your input, input on uh, what kind of content matters to you the most or what kind of content actually helps you the most. Um, what exactly do you want to see uh, from me here on YouTube if it's only, you know, um, hair and makeup and, you know, my daily life things, which is not very exciting, but at the moment, <laughs> I'm about to give me a boo, okay? No, I'm just kidding. But anyway, um, if you want to see only that or, um, you know, are you okay with um, encouragement and motivational um, type content? Because um, I do have a podcast and I kind of separated things for that purpose, um, but I'm finding the necessity to share, uh, you know, to share that type of uh, content on more than one platform because I know that, you know, no matter the audience, people need to hear from God, especially in times like these. They need to hear um, what God is saying. They need, the, some people are so confused and so afraid and, um, and they turn on, you know, people like us, you know, on YouTube who are supposed to be, um, you know, on a platform. We've been given this platform to speak. Um, they t they look at people like us and they wonder why we don't have more to say or, you know, um, they expect encouragement from us and we should be able to g actually give that encouragement. So, um yeah, I just want to know, like, will that will that help you here? Do you want that here or would you prefer for it to be on a separate channel? Now, um, when I very first started out on YouTube, I had two channels. It was very hard <laughs> to keep up with. As you can see, I could barely keep up with one, but I was trying to juggle two channels for that reason, because I assumed that people did not want to... Um, hear, you know, um, godly content or spiritual content on my beauty and lifestyle channel. There's a way that I could go about it. Like I could put it in a completely separate video so you could know like, you know, okay, this video is about, you know, this topic and I don't want to watch that. So I won't watch that one. I will watch the hair review or I will watch the vlog or whatever. Or is it okay to mix it in? Like do like a, like a chit, chit chat, get ready with me or something like that, where I am encouraging you while doing my makeup or doing my hair or something, or just uh, dropping it in a lifestyle vlog, which that will probably happen anyway, because it's just naturally going to flow out. And if, if I'm talking to the camera about, you know, something that's not really planned. So yeah, let me know if, let me know what you prefer. And then secondly, um, it's the issue like with the collaborations like r recently i've been um being contacted by uh, companies who want me to show hair and things for them and um, i've been doing those videos here uh, but what i'm noticing very early in the game is that uh, not all of these companies are um, integral and not all of these companies are professional um, some of them are really, really great, and some of them are on the complete opposite end of that spectrum, like the professional spectrum. And to me, professionalism is very important um, because I rate that, um, you know, according to uh, your level of integrity. I feel like if you're a person who is integral, then professionalism will flow naturally out of your integr integrity. Um, and I refuse to share any product that, number one, I don't love myself. Number two, um, 
I don't find um, integral or professional. Uh, and the reason why is because, and I don't care who it is. I don't care the name of the company. I don't care if they're a huge company or a small company. I don't care how affordable their product is or how great it is. If they are not an integral company or, you know, I will not share uh, that content with you at all. I will not share their product with you at all. I won't work with them at all. So um, that's the main reason. And for that reason, you know, I'm, you know, I'm finding that I have to turn down some offers and that's fine with me. It's not just about money for me. I have a job, you know, um, I would like to do YouTube, uh, full time if possible, but I'm not willing to compromise integrity for that. So not mine, you know, or anyone else's. So I really want to, sorry, my chair is like, sliding down i need a new chair guy i need a new chair guys like <laughs> my chair is like always like falling sliding down um the lever is not working properly I, i'm gonna try to figure out how to fix it but uh yeah that's pretty much why i'm asking you this question is because um um you know the, the type of the type of content that I want to uh, produce or create for you guys um, I want it to be you know extremely professional and and down to earth at the same time I want it you know natural at the same time I can't help but be me that's just me um, and I'm I am somewhat of a perfectionist so that's why you probably always see me changing things here because I'm always like um, you know seeing looking for ways to improve what I do um, and um, that goes for everything from the actual nature of the content to the aesthetic of the channel and everything um, so yeah just kind of give me your input and on that if you will please um engage me and let me know what you think um about this channel what you'd like to see on this channel what would really help you the most um and and things like that um and again i i can't be more clear i'm very open to any type of um advice um uh, I hope it's, you know, I hope it's on a pause. It's coming from a positive place. Um, critique if it's coming from a positive place, you know, as well. You know, just, you know, I, I believe in treating others the way that you want to be treated. So, yeah, if you can just let me know what you what you uh, think or what you'd like, that would help me so much. Um, what else did I want to say? Oh, so. So, yeah, other than that, just. What are you guys doing this week? Like, are you going crazy staying inside? I know many of you are working from home nowadays. And, you know, how are you liking that? Welcome to the club. <laughs> so, yeah, plans for the day. Um, I am going to um, get my little workout in. I'm about to have some brunch. And then I'm going to make me uh, a smoothie. I might make a smoothie for brunch. No, I need to make brunch because I need to cook because my son is here. Um, and he needs to eat um, and yes he does cook by the way but uh, I've been making some really great breakfast and um, I think he's looking forward to that so I'm gonna do that my plans for the rest of the day um, I pretty much want to continue my spring cleaning I've been doing spring cleaning here and there throughout this week and um, I think today I want to finish my closet because I started decluttering my closet uh, several weeks ago and I did not finish it to be very honest and it's been kind of build, building again building up again and I need to give it a good clean so I'm gonna do that and um, yeah that's pretty much it just kind of cleaning up around the house and um, prepping content uh, for YouTube prepping content for um my podcast which is a bit dusty and i need to just kind of revamp um yeah that's pretty much all so yeah i don't want to bore you guys so i'm gonna get off for now and stop rambling and i will uh catch you guys in the kitchen my poo poo says hi say hi He's posing for you guys.
so I am making breakfast. Uh, Tariq is blending a smoothie behind me, so um, yeah, just making breakfast. This is spinach, mushroom, you know the drill, eggs, um, and this is uh, meatballs I have in here, turkey meatballs, and I'm making like a Swedish uh, meatball um, stew to go with rice, so I have this frying and some olive oil and tomato sauce. And then I'm going to add um, these uh, sauces uh, to it and make it like a, um, a creamy Alfredo situation. Uh, I saw a recipe um, on Instagram from one of my, uh, well, one of the people that I follow. Her name is Esther. And um, she just recently did um, a, a great recipe that has like poblano. It's like a poblano... Um, Alfredo like pasta that she did and it looks so amazing so I want to try that but yeah it's too late well I can't try it today because I don't have the poblano peppers but um, next time I'm able to go out I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try that one and I'll show it to you guys and it'll actually be a pasta dish not this because this is gonna be stew and rice because we actually had pasta yesterday my son's uh, smoothie that he's making and what do you have in here I have milk, bananas, uh, peanut butter, two chocolate chip cookies, sugar, and ice. Two chocolate chip cookies. Wow. Yep. <laughs> so he's about to blend this up. Okay, so he's adding granola. He forgot the granola. I forgot to tell him about it too because we did granola before and it was really, really good. So he's just adding some banana nut granola to this. So here is my brunch uh, plated and this is French bread with olive oil. And there's my smoothie. So that's what Tariq's looks like. So here is dinner, you guys. This is my stew and rice. I didn't take too much meat because I am trying to cut back. So yeah, this is what my dinner is looking like. Please make sure to take your apple cider vinegar during this time. Like, it will help you so much um, with your immune system, with your digestive system, with every system, and you can lose some weight if you need to. So <laughs> apple cider vinegar. So I'm gonna show y'all this again. Apple cider vinegar, about that much is fine orange juice about that much is fine down the hatch that's all you gotta do follow it with water and there you go do this before your morning meal and your evening meal and you will be good to go Sorry. and I have another one right here and I'm also taking these uh, Ollie probiotics. They're 66 milligrams, which is 1 billion CPU of live culture in here. So definitely you're getting your probiotic value. And because this is citrus blend um, or tropical mango blend, then it is also packed with vitamin C. Mm -hmm. 